tip is to go from above and get lots of light. <laughs> well, when I first started taking pictures, I would do a lot of portraits uh, around kind of, I used to race my cross, so I'd race a lot of motocross, doing portraits of people at car racing. And it's, it's growing up looking at all those kind of great pictures done in the 60s and 70s of motor car racing and everything else. And my love affair is that I never actually wanted to do fashion, it was accidental, I actually got into it. Uh, but yeah, the, um, I don't know, I, I just became very good at it. I don't know why, I think it made was a hairdresser or something, I don't know. But it's other things, but uh, just taking you know, portraits of the anguish and um, you know, the, the people around car tracks and you know, the, you know, losing a race and you know, I've raced myself, I race a lot of motorbikes and losing a race is, you know, it's, it's like the worst thing that could ever happen to you, you know, coming second is not good, so, you know, I was coming first, so that's why I started to take pictures around that, so. You know, I'm always like, uh, for cars, when I look at cars, I'm obsessed by design and lines. It has to mean something that I, I, you know, I have another card. I, I think that cars are in shape, sexiness, the curves and everything else. You know, I've, I've followed car design for a year, for almost 30 years. You know, I know a lot of people collaborating with cars, developers, car designs, and, you know, from, from great architects to artists and everything else. And if, I, if the car intrigues me, you know, I'm, I'm pretty obsessed by design. So. <laughs> You know, the, the car's an incredible design. It's like beautifully shaped. It's like amazing curves on it. And uh, also, what a great choice of a model to put with it as well. I think you can, uh, you can accentuate, when you're lighting a car, whether it's like in a model or anything else, you can accentuate it with the light. You can make the car like it's smooth and more liquid. It's, uh, it can, it, you know, it doesn't have to be a, a still object. And if you think in your, in, in your mind it's a still object, then you light it like a still object. But everything to me with Carolina or, or uh, I think kind of is the car's moving, she's moving in my mind. So, you know, like today, for instance, you know, for me, she was taking it for like a walk. And that was the idea. She was like moving with the car. She's taking it somewhere. And you can you can do emphasize that with light and camera trickery and everything else. But uh, I never see I never see things as static anyway. Yeah, when I was, uh, I, when, they, when they came up and sort of talked to me about photographing Mercedes, the idea, I wanted to marry and make, I didn't think about doing a car advertising, I wanted to make a fashion image, and where the girl was actually blended within the car. It wasn't just about doing a car advertising for me, the thing had to be an old image, like the, the fashion image that stood out with her. So it's to marry these two together and how to, you know, to collaborate her and the car. You know, I never thought about it as a car ad, I just thought about it as making an image, and that's what I did.